Officials across the state are preparing for the statewide mask mandate, which goes into effect in a matter of hours. Governor Tony Evers issued the mandate yesterday. It goes into effect at midnight. The order requires everyone five and older to wear a mask while indoors around other people outside of your home. There are exceptions for eating, drinking, or if you have a health condition or disability. Violators could be fined up to $200. But there are still questions as to how that will be enforced. Several law enforcement agencies in Adams County, Dodge County, Grant County, Greene County, Lafayette County, and Prairie du Chien all say they can't or won't issue violations. That means enforcement will mostly be left up to businesses in those areas. New at 6, Tony Galley spoke with a business owner in Greene County about the challenges of enforcing the order and why he won't participate. Our veterans fought for us to have choices. In May, this bar defied Governor Evers, opening before the governor's safer at home order was struck down by the state Supreme Court. A lot of false promises. Um, actually, now that I know what I know from the last few months, I would never close again. And owner Joel Postema is encouraged by Dodge County Sheriff Dale Schmidt, who is identifying significant challenges for enforcement and loopholes with the mask order. With of Dodge County's Sheriff Joel Postema appears safe to take this hands-off attitude to the mask mandate. He's also hoping his financial suffering is behind him as he plans for a big event here next weekend where many motorcycles and others from all over are likely to show up. Uh, we got three bands coming in. So far there's 400-ish, believe, people that are interested in on Facebook. Masks may not be policed there, but nearby, Beaver Dam Police will follow up on complaints over masks not worn in businesses' buildings. We don't determine the law. We follow uh, orders from the governor, whether it's a Democrat or a Republican. We give that respect and know that an order from the governor is supersedes. There are differing opinions on masks and on enforcement. All my customers have a choice. I mean. In Dodge County, Tony Galley, 27 News.